Hey guys, it's Young Wealth. Now today we have to ask the question, right? Is $500 for ICP fiction or reality? Is it a dream or reality? We're gonna really find out today in today's video. We're gonna break that down. When are gonna get to the bottom of this? We're gonna actually get to the bottom of it until all the meat is off the bone, okay? So at the end of the day, let's get into the video, right? Now, as you can see, before we start, Let's just look at the price point and how ICP is actually doing. If you can see at the chart right now, we're up 6%. Now, I remember when it got as low as around $11.59. So if you actually got in that $11.59, you actually are a nice profit margin right now. So it's like, it's all about timing the buy, okay? But sometimes you cannot time the buy. So what do you do? You dollar cost average, right? If we go to the seven day, we can actually see we are up 20%. Just look at that. Just, just, just look at that, man. Just look at it, bro. That is a gateway to heaven. Like that, that is the staircase to heaven. Look at this, this green line here. That's just, that's the staircase to heaven, if you ask me. Let's go to the monthly. I'm gonna get into whether we can hit five hundred dollars or not, right? As you can see, it looks like we're actually having a mean reversal here. So, guys, get prepared for anything because the Bitcoin halving has passed, right? So, it's to the point where, like, I'm going to be honest with you guys, we can either see a crash or we can see actually skyrocket. But I do feel like we are going to get a crash because I do feel like Bitcoin was overextended and Bitcoin had a lot of actual catalyst to actually go up. But right now, the only catalyst is the halving. The catalyst we were working off with actually ETFs. But now the catalyst is the half and until we get some more catalyst, I think like we have to wait a little bit. So with that being said, let's actually get into if ICP can hit $500 or not, right? Now, I don't like to waste time on my videos. I'm just going to tell you off rip right now. Yes, ICP can hit $500. And the reason is, is because you have to understand that we have more potential than BNB. We have more potential than BTC. We have more potential potential than XRP. We have more potential than LTC. All of these tokens. Like if you just go to the top ten, we have more potential than every single token in the top ten. Now, as you can see, we are in the top eighteen. We have more potential than Polygon. I'm sorry, Chainlink. All of these tokens. And the reason I say that is because when we're looking at this, this is something very important. I have to show you guys. Internet computers actually focus on actually making IT more efficient with their computer system. So it's to the point where like they are focused on making IT more efficient. And what do I always tell people? If you are trying to get rich and mega rich, find a big problem and find a solution to that problem and find a shortcut to that problem because humans love shortcuts. Humans love it when it's easier. So now we know that I had to type in IT industry value, right? It says the information technology market size has grown strongly in recent years. It will grow from 8,508 billion in 2023 to 9,039 billion in 2024 at a compound annual growth rate of 6%. So if I'm not mistaken, that's a market cap or well, that's an evaluation of around the IT industry is worth nine trillion. Let me say that one more time. The IT industry is worth nine trillion. If ICP was to get 10% of that share, let's just say 8% of the share, right? ICP was to actually get 8% of the share, right? That means the market cap will be 720 billion, guys. Let me say that one more time. The market cap will be 720 billion. And if we just go to the current circulating supply today, we can figure out what the price point would be if the if the circulating supply was to stay the same, right? Which is not gonna happen, but let's just divide it by 462 million, right? 462 million. What does that give you? <laughs> that gives you a price point of $1,558, $1,500. dollars per ICP. And if you ask me, when we're talking about the long term, we can have multiple coins over a trillion in market cap. We can have multiple coins, like we can have five coins that are over 500 billion in market cap. It's just gonna take some time, but that's a fraction of what we need for ICP to hit $500. So let's just do the math for $500, okay? Let's just do the math for $500. So. 
462 million, right? Times $500. Guys, we literally only need to hit a $231 billion market cap. When we're talking about, remember now, we are talking about a coin that is actually in the IT industry and has one of the strongest use cases for IT. So it's to the point where we know the IT industry is actually nine trillion built or nine trillion dollars in 2024, and its growth rate is around six point two percent. Its growth rate is around six point two percent. So it's to the point where, like, if as I said before, if we can get a fraction of that, if we can get just five percent of that, we are already past five hundred dollars, guys. So I'm not here to clickbait or make it like, oh yeah, this is a lie, because I believe it full heartedly that a, to a token like this can actually go further than what it is. It can go further than $150. It can go further than $200. This coin could go past $500 just off, just off its utility. And you must understand that the user growth over this next decade or so, this next five to seven years is going to be very substantial. So now we know the user growth is going to be very substantial. What does that mean? That means more users, which equals more volume, which equals more market cap, which equals a higher price point. I just want to be as honest as possible on this video and just tell you that, yes, we are going to hit $500 eventually. The only way we don't hit $500 is if cryptocurrency dies altogether. But if cryptocurrency is actually the future and we are here to stay, then this can go anywhere from 500 to 1.5 thousand, 1.5K. This can go anywhere from $500 to 1.5K if you ask me. That's why I'm accumulating and that's why I keep buying these dips and that's why I'm dollar cost averaging. Like I actually got some at $12 the other day. So I'm just looking real good right now because my entry point for most of my icp was at 11 dollars, so it's like to the point where like let's just do the math real quick 15 to 500 okay 15 to 500 which is probably a 40x if i'm not mistaken or 33x my bad bad math but at the end of the day that's a 33x right so it's to the point where like if you only put in let's just say you put in two thousand dollars right $2,000, you're making 66,000 back, 66,000 back. And if you decide to stay there for, for eight years, you're making double that. So that's just time by two. You're making 133,000. So I'm very interested to see what ICP is going to do in these markets. I'm very intrigued to see how far it can go, how good it can perform. But I do believe like this could be the next BNB when it comes to growth and actual recognition it could be the next bitcoin when it comes to actually dominance because i do feel like this coin has the use case to actually be a dominant coin in the market and actually be one of those coins that outshine majority of cryptos so with that being said it was actually young wealth hope you guys enjoyed the video smash the like button hit the subscribe button and also turn on the post notification bells if you guys want to be part of my discord be sure to join the patreon link in the description that will support me and it will also support you back because you're going to be learning about different gems over there with that being said it was young wealth i'm signing out with another video peace